Road to GH will reveal that Olivia will soon discover that Ned is not only obsessed with money, but also willing to use ruthless measures to achieve his goals. While she tries to keep her family intact, Ned quietly gathers evidence of Willow and Drew's affair. Upon discovering this, Ned doesn't stop at blackmailing Drew to gain ELQ shares, but also attempts to exploit the situation to weaken Michael's power within the family. Olivia feels deeply disappointed as she realizes Ned has become too deeply involved in financial schemes, putting personal ambition and corporate interests above family happiness. When Stephen Weber returns to Port Charles to reunite with his mother, Heather Weber, after her release from prison, things quickly become complicated. Stephen not only wants to repair his relationship with his mother, but also hopes to reconnect with his son, Leo, whom he hasn't had much opportunity to be a real father to. As Stephen tries to bond again with Olivia and Leo, Ned Quartermain can't hide his selfishness and jealousy. Ned begins to feel threatened by Stephen's presence. Although Ned has been a substitute father for Leo during Stephen's absence, he can't bear the thought of Stephen re-entering Olivia and their son's lives. Ned's anxiety escalates to the point where he decides to forbid Olivia from allowing Leo to meet Stephen, his biological father. Ned rationalizes that this is in Leo's best interest, but in reality, it stems from his fear of losing control within the family. Olivia, feeling pressure from both sides, begins to struggle internally. On one hand, she understands that Leo has the right to know his biological father and should have a relationship with Stephen. On the other hand, she doesn't want to disrupt the stability of her family or hurt Ned, who has been taking care of Leo. Olivia's growing dissatisfaction with Ned intensifies as she realizes that not only is Ned obsessed with money and power, but he has also become selfish, wanting to control even her personal life. The tension between Olivia and Ned becomes inevitable. Stephen, though only seeking to reconnect with his son, inadvertently becomes the source of these conflicts. Ned, consumed by jealousy and anxiety, may make drastic decisions that threaten the fragile balance of the family. The big question will be whether Olivia stands up to protect Leo's rights and confronts Ned, and whether she can find a balance between the two men in her life. Ned doesn't stop at jealousy and selfishness, but goes even further by threatening Olivia. He warns that if he catches Olivia meeting Stephen again, he won't be lenient with Leo, their autistic son whom Olivia loves deeply. This threat sends chills down Olivia's spine and she feels utterly betrayed by Ned. From being overly driven by power and finances, Ned is now turned into a dangerous man, willing to use her son as a pawn to control Olivia's life. For Olivia, this is the final straw. The tension in her marriage reaches its peak as she realizes she cannot continue with a husband who is willing to use their child as a tool in his power struggle. For her, family love always comes first, and Ned's threat to Leo makes her feel that she cannot stay with such a man. Stephen Weber's return, along with his desire to reconnect and care for Leo, makes Olivia realize that she needs to make a change. Stephen may have had an imperfect past, but his love for Leo and Olivia is genuine. He wants to make up for past mistakes and care for his son, especially as Leo needs special attention due to his autism. Disgusted and disappointed by Ned's true nature, Olivia decides to make a bold decision. She proposes to divorce Ned. For her, nothing is more important than Leo's happiness and safety, and she realizes that staying with Ned will only bring conflict and danger to her son. Olivia hopes that by reuniting with Stephen, they can both care for Leo and build a proper family, where Leo can grow up in a loving and stable environment. Olivia's decision to file for divorce not only shocks Ned, but could also trigger significant consequences within the Quartermain family. Will Ned accept the reality that he has lost both Olivia and Leo? And will Olivia and Stephen be able to overcome their past to rebuild a future for Leo? The story becomes complex and tense, leading to many emotional and unpredictable moments in the journey of Olivia, Stephen, and Ned. Will Olivia succeed in divorcing Ned and protecting her son Leo from Ned's threats? These tense developments will continue to unfold in future episodes of General Hospital. Ned, with his power-hungry and ambitious nature, may not easily let go. He might try to manipulate the situation even using his wealth and power at ELQ to obstruct the divorce and threaten Leo's custody. 
However, Olivia is showing more strength than ever, determined to protect her son, especially since Leo requires special care and love due to his autism. Stephen, with his desire to reconnect and care for Leo, will be a significant source of support for Olivia in this battle. But Stephen's complicated past, including his relationship with his mother, Heather, may create additional challenges. Stay tuned to General Hospital to discover whether Olivia can overcome all obstacles and find peace for herself and Leo. The conflicts, intertwined emotions, and the battle to protect her family will be revealed in upcoming episodes.